Hey, how's it going, guys? We're here talking some Penn State football today. So, uh, Disa Isaac, one of the key defensive linemen on this year's team, is likely out for the season. It was just announced recently, and I think this is definitely a, a hit on the team. I'd, it's not like one of the biggest hits, I would say. Like, it's not like a Jahan Dotson or Sean Clifford or even a P.J. Mustafer type injury, but Adisa Isaac certainly was going to factor into being a very important player for us, and um, he might have been our best defensive end on the team. So losing him kind of makes kind of makes things harder for us, uh, especially with um, some kind of unknown ability on the D line. Um, we don't really know much about Arnold Abiquetti other than he did really well at Temple. Um, and then you got guys behind him that have gotten maybe a little bit of playing time over the course of the careers, like Smith Vilbert or uh, Nick Tarburton, who you've been hearing good things from coaches, but you haven't really seen it in game yet. So you just hope that what the coaches are saying is not just lip service, that it's actually true. And uh, when they do get their time on the field, they'll actually be able to contribute. Um, and it's just uh, some other guys too, like Jesse Lucado, who started at linebacker last year. Uh, he's been getting a lot of time at the end in practice. We'll see how much time he actually gets there in game. Uh, I don't know exactly how good he is at the end. It'd be great if he is because they can move him there. He'd be very versatile and he can be a very productive player for us at either D end or linebacker. That'd be nice. And, um, yeah. And other than that, I mean, you got like a mean van over who's a second year freshman now. Um, it's just, there's not, I guess there's some optimism there. Like I, I'm not going to say that they're like screwed at the end, but there, there's just so much, so many questions and things are not to go right. Um, and hopefully, you know, I think the talent, there's talent there. It's just that they're going to need to be able to go out and perform. And um, this may be the weakest group on the team is defensive line. I mean, I think everywhere else they're pretty solid. I mean, linebacker, they're not very deep, but their starters I think are good. And, uh, you know, defense line is obviously an important spot, and hopefully they'll be able to uh, be kind of how they were the last couple of years, or not last year, but 2018-2019. Um, they were they were one of the elite groups in the nation, I'd say, with Etor Gross Matos and Sharif Miller, and uh, even like Antonio Shelton was a pretty good D-tackle for us, Robert Windsor, you know, some, some guys who have been pretty good for us. Hopefully we can um, have more guys turn into – I like that, like a Shaka Tony or even an OA, you know, just we need to be able to replenish the defensive line talent, and I think we have some guys to do it, and hopefully a couple of them will step up. I right, well, thank you guys. We are Penn State.